Hello everyone and welcome to my GDFI playlist and in this video I'm going to show you the basic step you need to do before you can install any mod in GDFI. So I'm going to break this video into two segments. The first video I'm going to show you how to install the basic trainer and in the second video I'm going to show you what are the necessary files required to install any mod in GDFI. So this uh, basic trainer will have various options and you can mess with these options to make the character go faster, change time, change weather and lots more. So to do this we require to download three files and we are going to copy their content into the GDFI folder. So let's get started. So the first file which we require is the script hook 5. Uh, the second file is scripthook5.net and simple trainer. So download them. And the second one. file which you need to download is scripthook5.net.zip so this is the file which we require at last uh, the simple trainer so after downloading these three files I'm gonna just paste them in my desktop so before, I, uh, before proceeding to the next step what we are gonna do is we need to find in which directory our GTA 5 has been installed to. So if you don't know in which directory your game is installed, what you can do is you can just right click on the GTA 5 icon on your desktop and click open file and location. So this should give you the location of the game. So after that we are just going to open the first file, uh, the script hook uh, 5 and we are going to go inside the folder called bin. In that we are just going to select the two files, the first and the last one and just drag them to the game folder. Since I already have these files, I'm just gonna replace them. Now we have to do the same, uh, similar stuff for the rest of the two files. And last uh, is the trainer, and here we need to drag the last two files and paste it in the directory. After we are done copying the files, uh, we are just going to run the game to check how this trainer works. Uh, right now we are standing on the top of a building and I have not enabled any feature in the trainer. And uh, if you can see I don't have any weapons too. So if we are just going to jump off a building, we are going to die if we don't open the parachute. Ah! <laughs> so now that we have died, we are going to check out the trainer. So to check the features of the trainer, just uh, press F4 to get the trainer screen and you can see we have a bunch of options. So now I am going to play with few options. First I am going to enable the god mode uh, just to make sure that I don't die. And I didn't have weapons before so I'm gonna get all my weapons. So yes, I have weapons now. Missed. You won't. So we have enabled this trainer. Now we will see what we can do next. We spawn a vehicle. This time we'll do supercars. Oh, that's fun. That's pretty cool. Let's see whether we can raise the star to 5. Increase one to level to 5 stars. Now it's gonna be fun.
so let's try another thing. Bodyguard. It's spawn some bodyguards. Oh my god, I think this is a Protect me now. I've been teleported. Hmm, that's that's real good. That's really real good. they're searching here too. Let's try to clean something better. I want thunder. guys uh, so please uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, like this video and i'll be posting such videos in the future too uh, thank you guys